before we uh, get started with this video, I want to explain a few things. Um, one being, you probably noticed that I don't chase down a lot of singles. We do try to hunt the singles down here sometimes. Um, but if it's a smaller covey, I try to stay away from them because I obviously want them, you know, I want them to stay there and live. And, you know, if I don't shoot them on the rise, then so be it. I'll, you know, hopefully they'll live till next year. Um, but the bigger coveys, I do try to chase down the singles. But as anybody knows that hunts down here, it's super tough because um, as soon as they get to their escape cover here, there's no going in the escape cover. I mean, they're going into a swamp or you know a really some really thick stuff that's not huntable so just like today um i could have hunted the singles from this covey some of the singles that went off to the left they went on some private ground the stuff that went off to the right i start walking over there and i come around the corner and there's a guy and his son and um, his dad they're getting some firewood so i didn't go over there and hunt try to hunt those birds right around them um i didn't really feel I didn't really feel like I should do that with those people right there. So, but yeah, just wanted to uh, let y'all know and, you know, tell y'all that's why, if you're wondering, it's really tough down here to hunt the singles. So, anyways, uh, I'm going to get, uh, let y'all see the video. Good morning, y'all. It's uh, Christmas Eve. Really cold weather this morning. It's beautiful out here. Um, I don't know how the audio is going to be with the wind blowing pretty hard, but, uh, Super blessed. My wife lets me get out here and you know, hunt a lot. She's watching this. Love you, babe. But I uh, found a covey this morning. Whiffed on both shots. I stepped over a log and about busted my butt, but nice covey. Hallie pointed and uh, Chip came in. He backed her, but he had a nose full of them, those birds too. But uh, I hope y'all enjoy this. Hunting a little bit of a clear cut today. And, yeah, you know, I was pretty down this morning. I hunted a spot. Walked a long ways. And didn't come up with anything. But try this new spot over here. And ended up finding some birds. So hope y'all enjoy it. So first thing this morning. We're probably 200 yards from the truck. Chip points and uh. I don't know if there had been some birds in here or not, but he eventually moves on from it, but he sure was acting birdie. Okay. Come on, Hallie. Hallie, right here. So this next spot we came to is a uh, probably two to three year old clear cut with some young pines planted in it. It's a pretty good quail cover. I didn't see a ton of food in this stuff. I don't know if they're going into the pines on the edges and you know finding something to eat and then kind of coming back and hanging out in this stuff during the day. So my GPS said Hallie was on point and I saw her over there so I just kind of slowed up a little bit and let Chip work this area too and you can kind of tell he's he's already working the birds he doesn't see her yet so Chip comes in right here and as soon as he gets around the, these palmettos right here he uh, locks up and I'm pretty sure he was had a nose full of these birds but if not he was either backing her or had a nose full of them but it was pretty and the covey gets up here in a minute. I tripped over this log as I, the birds got up and man, I just whipped. I'd love to show y'all some more footage, but uh, this is what happens whenever you miss and you can't chase down the singles. Show y'all what I was hunting today. Um, so when I picked this spot out, I noticed that there was obviously a clear cut here, but 
along this edge to the right. I noticed there were some open ponds. Look like they've been thinned. And uh, so I parked right over in this area, hunted down through these thinned out ponds and then made my way through the clear cut. And you can see this little chunk of taller ponds right here. And when I made it to the other side of this, that's where we found the covey at. And uh, that's just kind of stuff that I look for as far as a transition between these big ponds that are thinned out and this clear cut. And uh, you can see, you know, there's bare ground. It looks kind of sandy, which is another thing I look for. But just wanted to show you all that.